All right, Vernon Fox, the head coach from Faith Lutheran High School in Las Vegas, joins us right now. Eight years in the NFL and six years as the head coach at Faith Lutheran. And first of all, Coach, thanks a lot for joining us on We Coach. And also, I want to know, what have you learned over the past six years as a head football coach in high school? I've learned how to be a better servant. I say that, um, you know, one of the things that I quickly figured out is that uh, leadership uh, really, really, truly is servanthood. And um, I just have the opportunity to stay connected to a game that's been a tremendous blessing in my life. Um, and to be able to infuse ministry with that in the place that I'm at here at Faith Lutheran, it's just been a tremendous privilege and an honor. Vernon, tell us a little about your childhood growing up and your family life. I was born here in Las Vegas, Nevada. Uh, was you know blessed to grow up in a home where both of my parents were present. Um, to this day, you know they've been married almost 40 years, and so uh, that has just been a tremendous honor and a privilege um, to to have that foundation at home. Um, you know, I grew up in a God-fearing home. I I attended church at a very young age and was exposed to the things of Christ. Uh, at an early age and you know really really dug in deep in regards to my relationship with christ um you know my father is a strong man he is you know my hero i, I was that type of kid growing up when people would say well who's your hero and you know people would be saying superman and you know athletes and and i would always say my parents and my father they contacted you you weren't even thinking about coaching high school football. Is that correct? Correct. Um, <laughs> yeah, no, I was, uh, I, I always tell people that, you know, a lot of uh, professional football players, when they retire from the NFL, you know, it's kind of one of two things that they go into. They either go into coaching or broadcasting, and I had no desire to do either. Um, a lot of lessons along the way, but uh, God has really pruned me through this process, and uh, it's been a privilege. What were your wife's feelings? Uh, initially. You know what? I don't think she knew what we were getting into. <laughs> you know what? I don't know if I truly knew as well. Um, obviously, being a player and a coach are two different things. I wanted um, stability for my family. I, I didn't want to be moving around, uh, which is one of the reasons why I have not pursued an opportunity to coach in college. Um, I, I really just like having uh, stability in the life of my family and just, you know, wasn't interested in living that life. And I, one of the things I said to them early on was that if this position was going to be predicated on, you know, a number of wins and, and it was all about getting someone to come in here and, you know, turn the program around for the sake of being a winning program, I probably wouldn't be the person um, because that wasn't necessarily my sole focus. Obviously, like you said, I want to win. Um, I want to operate at a high level of efficiency and excellence and prepare hard and, and do the best that we can to be successful. But at the end of the day, I realize, you know, the vast majority of these young men won't go on to play in college or certainly not at the pro level. And so if all we do is make them better football players, I, I don't feel like I'm needing the call that God has, has commissioned character, integrity, accountability, and excellence. I wanted those things written in stone. You know, the Bible says in Habakkuk 2, it says to write the vision and make it plain. And, and that was important to me. I wanted anyone that was going to be a part of this program to know what we would stand for and who our identity would be in. And, and that was, you know, on the sole purpose of our scripture, which is Proverbs 16 and three, which says, commit to the Lord, whatever you do and your plans will succeed. Um, I believe that the success we would receive would be doing it God's way. Well, coach uh, Vernon Fox, from Faith Lutheran High School in Las Vegas, Nevada. Thank you very much for joining us on We Coach. You are an inspiration to a lot of coaches out there and coaches and their spouses, and we appreciate you joining us this afternoon. Thank you so much, No, Like I said, it, it is a tremendous privilege, and, and I've grown so much just in my time coaching. I, I, I feel like this last six years, has really just been a transformation on my life and you know just really just walking in a greater purpose of who God created me to be uh, for a long time I thought I was created to play football and, and I quickly learned that that was just a platform that God was preparing for me um, to have a greater level of impact which I feel like I'm, I'm walking in that right now so thank you so much for allowing me to be a part of this.